Okay. Um, I'm solving some new problems with um this adventure that I've been having. You know, the giant puzzle piece. So last week I stuck. I showed you that this this piece right here, all these pieces, they match up with those pieces. They sandwich together, so you can open them up because this art is hidden. When the piece is on the wall, covered by these these guys. So it's covered up by these guys. What I found out is, um, since they both have magnets on them <laughs> to keep them together, one thing I did not know, after three days, you know, you ignore them for a while, maybe five days, I ignored them for a while, and I, I, I left them alone. I left them stuck together. What happened last night is I tried to remove them, you know, un, uh, uh, unstick them, you know, because it's just a magnet holding them. So, you know, I thought it would be just simple, just remove them and, um, nope. It turns out the pressure of the magnet, uh, the, these very strong magnets, each one of them being 120 five pounds of hold um, so you add those up there's two in there and there's two of those magnets in there two magnets in there so you have a total of let me see 125 yeah so let me just say 500 pounds of pressure yeah, 500 pounds, not 500, is it? Yeah, it is 500. So 500 pounds, you know, pressure pushing them both together. And what happened is something that usually happens to art pages and sometimes when I put a piece of paper or a piece of board against the wall for a while and I'm not using it. Uh, six months later I try to you know remove it from a wall and I and it's kind of hard to remove from the wall it just sticks there. It's either water damage or it just humidity. So it, it sticks together. And it would not let those pieces go. And that's a problem. <laughs> because if I put the piece together, and this thing is supposed to be removable, anyone can come in and just remove it so they can see this other part of the piece. You can't have it just go permanently sticking it. So. It took a while and a lot of brute force just to unstick them. So I had to think of other ways of solving this problem. Everything here is funny because um, I need to know more physics than I know art to build this thing. It was a challenge to do it. And I challenge myself to do it, but it is what it is. And um, so what I figured out is um, I'm going to put another coat of something else on top of each of these, each of these sides. Maybe some wax medium that helps helps things don't stick together 
but it might be as simple as another another piece of board it's either I'm gonna cut a little it's either I'm gonna cut a little foam, foam again into that shape and put that in between them so they don't stick to each other but I have to solve, solve that problem and I don't have time to think about it so I have to make sure the solution I go for well, I could both go for both solutions but the solution I go for needs to work and that's what's up so I have um seven more pieces to to add to add the um, the magnets to after I've finished with the magnets and, and, and making sure that they are hidden inside and that the magnet still works. I had to other two more because they shattered I kept shattering them so these are very brittle yeah. they have some things even though they're nice and shiny and um, they look like they're fully metal they're not fully metal I gotta move this away because it's doing funny things to the image. But those magnets are not fully metal. They're just nickel plated. They're rare earth magnets. They have some rare earth material inside that makes them very strong. So, But that makes them brittle. So, so right now, so far, it's going well without those other problems, like the stickiness. I knew it was going to stick together because I've seen this problem before. If you have a, if you have, as an artist, if you have a, a book that you put your sketches in or simple paintings or if you you know you do an art journal and you just have art on each page depending on the medium you use sometimes even if it's acrylic or watercolors whatever you use and if you paint it on both sides of the pages the pages might stick together unless you you use something that will stop it from sticking. And the way this is, acrylic is very plasticky and sticky. So even if you cover your acrylic with some something to seal it, it's going to be sticky. So I think I'm going to use some wax medium and hope that works. If that doesn't work, I'm going to try that. And let it dry and if that doesn't work I'll have to cut the shape and put one of those another layer here between it to finish that just makes it thicker but and it kind of takes away from the thing but I've been thinking about putting a piece between that Maybe every time they have a new employee, they can find that, that piece of puzzle and then put it back. But it all depends on how safe this thing is. I haven't really tested it on the wall yet. And so when it's, when it's in my studio space, it's in my studio space. But... 
happens on the wall is a very different thing. So that's what I'm, my, my anxiety is mostly about that, getting to that space and installing that thing in the space that you designed it for and hoping that it works. So that's my update for August 2021. What's today's date? Is it the third? I think it's the third. I'm not sure it's the third or it's the fourth. I don't know. I think I paid my rent today. I did pay my rent today, but um, yeah, so I almost messed this up because that stuff was stuck. <laughs> It would not, it would not let go. It really would not let go of these things. I'm like, okay. It won't let go. I'm like, yep. So, again, I'm going to explain it. They put one piece here, and the other one, they snap together. They both, both sides have magnets, so they come together. Because they have the same shape. If you align them properly, it's just one, one thick, thick shape. Boom. When you want to remove them, that's another thing. You'll need two hands for that. But as you can see, it's just layers. Now that was an easy removal, wasn't it? Very easy. There you go. It nicely removed. But if you leave that for a few days, Somehow, I don't know what kind of physics happens, but whatever the science is, they're gonna stick together like they don't, they don't like you. So that's how it's supposed to function. I don't know why that let go so easily. <laughs> I hope it's not broken, so. Anyway, that's the last update. I'm feeling some sickle cell pain and, and aches. And um, I'm going through the days and I'm working. Every day I've been working um, 12 to 16 hours on this. So I think I'm putting a lot of stress on my body. But... Um, it's been challenging but fun. I enjoy it. So, <sighs> I got more pieces to cut. Lots of cutting, lots of cutting, lots of cutting. So, peace until the next video.